right, here we go. Wait a minute. Was that life on Mars he was then? Last show. Anyway. Last show tonight. Yes, it's my last chance to bid LA goodbye. LA, yay! He said LA. That's what we are. What's this called again? Is that Last Dance or Last Chance, Dawn of Summer? We've had laughs, so many laughs. Laughs, so many laughs. So let's go. Let's yes, James. Last run before we're done. Play, play. It's gonna be great, great tonight. Oh, let's blow. See wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, there's, uh, you know, the, you know the wee dance thing he did with Coldplay, well, the wee kind of foot up thing? What about this one? That one where you sort of put your knees together. You sort of put your knees together, your feet are apart, though, and you're sort of bobbing. Watch him. You'll see him here, then. it? Look. That there. And you, and you have one horn on your thigh. Look. Look at him. See how his left horn goes to his thigh? His left. That. That thing. That, that one there. The one horn just, you sort, of, you sort of bend there a wee bit, put your knees together and that. Anyway. I, I please, no comments about uh, James Corden's body or anything like that. We're, we're criticising his character. Yeah. Thanks for not running me down. Get the rabbit thing, get the, 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 the mouse costume thing on and get the pump. Get out of the road, you idiot! That's what it's like, Nelly, honestly. It's just like New York. It's worse than New York. Shout. There's no tomorrow. Shh, shh, shh. Get out of the road, you idiot! Time to say goodbye to the show. This is it. There's no tomorrow. I gotta steal everything from CBS I can. This time next year I might be living in a van. We're going all out, we got nothing to lose. Hell, we even did a musical with Tom Cruise. I'm putting it out there, all my love and affection. Maybe finally I'll kidnap One Direction. So that uh, kidnaps kidnap Nesley funny. Um uh, kidnap kidnapping is real. Does anybody like this cunt? Listen, I don't know him. I don't know him. See all this stuff about he's actually kind of nasty to people and he's actually kind of rude and all that. And that he's horrible to kind of stuff. I, 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 don't, I don't want to have a fucking hate campaign. At the end of the day, he's a fucking human being. I know some of the, I know all the worst things that have ever been committed on earth have been done by human beings. It's not like human beings are, because somebody's a human being, that means... Like leave Malen, human be human being, human beings are the, the worst creatures on the planet. But um, so don't want to go out. We all hate James Corden. What if he fucking, 
You know, I don't know what it's like to endure that amount of fucking constant fucking hatred and his family seen it and all that. If it was like, oh, God's sake, James Corden, I fucking hate him like that. Um, but just as one person saying this, you know how there's that bit at the beginning and that, you know, that whole thing like that, right? Um, you don't, I get, I get how we taste it, but um, you'd be surprised. <laughs> nice one. Um, um, but it's not, it's not, I don't get any open, a lot of open hatred. I don't get people tweeting me constantly, going on about it constantly, how much they hate me, openly, everywhere, all the time. Um, like, oh, a fucking Twitter. It feels like at times, God, keep them, keep them, we don't want them, fuck them, we hate them. Um, but, See that bit? See what you just watched there? Now, I don't watch things like that and go, look at it, oh, it's all colourful and fun. <laughs> I, do, I do a wee bit. I would do that with anything, maybe. But, um, depending. I like lots of nice things and wholesome things and all that. I love stuff like that. But has anybody, wa did anybody, does anybody watch that? At this point, in the James Corden, you know, how people feel about him timeline and watch that and go oh I fucking love this I love him and oh this is this is a really good program and all the rest of it I bet I bet if we watched a whole fucking episode see that episode you know the the, the one that I watched a bit earlier I bet if we watched the whole lot of it we'd come out the other end of it gone like that you know what he's actually all right I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Don't worry. Um, I think we could come at that. We'd come at the other end. It gone. Uh, no, I think we'd come at the other end. It gone like that. I mean, uh, right? It's a bit. He kind of overacts a wee bit, and he seems a wee bit f fake now and again, and all that. But a lot of people are like that. Ah, he's all right. I, I, I don't hate him as much. All right, I don't hate him as much. I think. I think you should all be like that. You'd be like this, there'd be one bit in it, you'd go like that. <laughs> I know, that was a wee bit funny, but it's probably because somebody wrote it for him. He's all right, isn't he? I think you would say to people, you'd say to a pal, or somebody you know, maybe a stranger at a bar, a kind of dark, wee, dingy bar, you would have a drink and go, can I ask a question? I know we don't know each other, but what what would you think about, this is somebody that I know, you'd say it like that, this is somebody that I know, what would you think if a pal told you, or somebody you knew told you that they thought James Corden was alright, this is, this is like a pal, I mean, what'd you think of that? Uh, I don't know, I wouldn't respect them, I think they're weird. Aye, same here, same here, same here. Well, I'll let you, I'll let you go on your drink there. Mick and Lincoln thinks the subs. Just watched a Corden clip on Instagram, come here and it's the same. Listen, so that's him probably coming back to the, uh, coming back to Blighty. Probably, I'm assuming. So we're going to see a lot more of him. Um... Maybe working on a sitcom. Something like that. 